Mount Rushmore. The largest monument in the USA is a symbol of freedom, peace, and democracy. But after 64 years, Abraham Lincoln, Theodore Roosevelt, Thomas Jefferson, and George Washington badly need a facelift. A case for Karcher. The main problem is the lichen. This plant has roots that drill into stone, even into granite. In winter, this makes the stone porous and water gets into it. When the water freezes, the stone explodes. On top of that, the lichen produces an acid that damages the surface of the stone. This process is called biocorrosion. You can see it here. A project that would have been impossible without the tremendous efforts of the rangers of the National Park Service. They help wherever they can and are very receptive as regards new technologies. But above all, the rangers are glad that Karcher came up with a non-abrasive solution to clean their monument without damaging it or causing pollution. And we had some early proposals of chemical treatments to clean it, um, sandblasting or media blasting, and we're not comfortable with doing that because we were concerned about the damage it could um, create. At the start of the project, tons of materials and five diesel-powered high-pressure washers were brought to the top of Mount Rushmore. As there are no roads leading to the mountain, a helicopter was used. But there's no helicopter service for the workforce. Every morning, they have to climb the 600 feet to their workplace. No easy task in the thin, high-altitude air of South Dakota. It takes us half an hour to get to the top, if we're fast and we're not carrying any equipment. And with temperatures over 95 degrees Fahrenheit, that's pretty hard. A truly monumental task like cleaning Mount Rushmore requires a lot of preparation. The Karcher crew are experienced professionals. But with each new project, the cleaning experts have to face up to a new challenge. On Mount Rushmore, they have to operate for the first time with rope access. This technique is very safe, but no one must be afraid of heights. Naturally, you always have some respect. No one can tell me they have no fear, but it's part of the job. Makes you safer. As a part of their culture sponsoring program, Karcher are cleaning historic buildings and monuments all over the world for free. Cleaning these objects makes high demands, but in solving the problems, the experts gain valuable insights. And in this way, Karcher strengthens its position as a worldwide leader in cleaning technology. The main reason we're doing this is our culture sponsoring program. Besides that, there's always something new. Here, for example, we're using 600-foot high-pressure hoses. And it's things like this that go into the development of our products. Life of Berlin. Naturally, a project on this scale doesn't go unnoticed by the media. Newspapers, radio and TV, the whole world is talking about the great event. The gigantic media response reflects their interest in such exceptional projects. Mount Rushmore getting a little facial for the summertime. Now our beauty expert, NBC's Kevin Tibbles, has uncovered a spa treatment of monumental proportions. A German firm has donated a pressure wash of the four presidents' faces. It's amazing. It's probably this is a once-in-a-lifetime chance, especially for me. I'm from Germany, and I get more and more understanding how important this monument for, for your country is. And ordinary folks in America are all for it. The reactions are more than positive. Even when we were setting up the project, people were already thanking us. They're not only grateful that damage due to vegetation on one of their national monuments has been stopped, there's also a very obvious but unexpected visual improvement. Even on the way here, you see that they're much lighter and they stand out better. Great result. In fact, you can see a difference. It's very nice and bright now and, and uh, will be bright for many more years. 
And last not least, visitors to the park are delighted by the cleaning project. Looks like they're doing a good job. <laughs> they're doing it absolutely free, and that's a marvelous thing. We thank you. That's good international cooperation. <laughs> that's terrific. The fireworks are a traditional part of American Independence Day. And thanks to the Karcher Cleaning Project, the presidents will shine in all their glory once again for thousands of years to come. The cleaning of Mount Rushmore is just one of many Karcher projects to preserve major monuments and buildings worldwide. And it's a good example of international cooperation and friendship. So more projects will follow soon.